Eric. I've got the V4 Typhon out. Um, I haven't really been able to get out for a bash here lately. We've had just an insane amount of rain and uh, tropical storms and stuff uh, rolling through. So, uh, you know, finally I've you know had a couple minutes of some dry weather. So I'm gonna get out and uh, see if I can uh, break a personal best with the uh, V4 Typhon on the long jump. Um, I did uh, gear up to a 30 tooth pinion and I've got some foam tires on here. Um, I just kind of, you know, just tried to set the buggy up the best I could, uh, you know, get as much speed as I could for, you know, for the ramp hit because it definitely takes the right amount of speed. So anyway, I'm gonna give it a quick rip and uh, see what happens. All right, guys, I've got it marked out. That's 100 foot um, at that cone right there. And man, they need to bush hog this field. <laughs> this is like waist, like waist deep. And I've got the 200 foot cone right there. Ah, oh, we came just short of it again. Only if you can see it, but there's my cone right there to 200 mark. So that's probably about 190. Almost there. All right, guys, I'm gonna stand at this 100 foot mark right here and uh, see what happens. Good landing, but not quite the 200. That was not a good landing. You virtually have no control of the buggy in the air when it's <laughs> going that fast through the air and it's got foam tires on it. Well guys, here she sits. It's like I might have been a drive shaft a little bit. But there's the cone right there, the 200 foot mark, directly across from it. So we finally hit the, finally hit the 200, but it wasn't a uh, graceful landing. Cause uh, she was kind of wonky in the air, and it's really hard to control it. But I'll try it again. But I can, I can uh, definitely say she hit the 200 mark. So uh, pretty happy with that. Let's just see if we can get a better landing. A little bit better. <laughs> All right, guys, that's going to be it. It's getting dark on me. Uh, you know, despite, you know, nearly two weeks of, of rain and storms and I mean, just insane stuff. Um, I was finally able to get out, uh, you know, just do something a little bit different for you guys. Uh, you know, I was able to get the 200 foot mark, even though it wasn't the prettiest landing, you know, again, because it was just really, you know, really squirrely in the air and it's, and it's hard to control, you know, a buggy at altitude going that fast, you know, with, with uh, foam tires. So definitely did the best I can, but we'll definitely uh, try again, you know, to exceed that and see what we can do uh and again huge shout out to a mitch from m2c racing i mean everything on here is just is just bone solid uh the towers i mean the towers are still straight the chassis is still straight i got a screw coming out right there um you know I, I do have the locking suspension blocks on here which is saving my diff cases i haven't busted a diff case yet since i've had these on here um or an arm so I, so everything's definitely definitely holding up so all right guys we'll see you guys uh, next time rc duty one peace out Oh, shit. Oh. <laughs> oh, man, blew a tire in midair.